Hello and welcome back to another review in the channel. In today's review, we'll be trying out Inform Anderson Taliska, 87 rated. Does look very good. But lads, before we do get into the review, um, if you could leave a subscription, uh, I'll be very grateful for that. I'm trying to hit 100 subs before the end of the month. And if you boys could help by leaving a sub, um, that'd be greatly appreciated. But yeah, let's jump to the stats. 86 pace, 88 dribbling, 84 passing, 87 shooting, 81 physical. Does look very good. Um, the acceleration as well and the pace is very good. Acceleration is a very important stat this year, um, especially after this, after you do a step over. Um, the step over is a very OP skill move this year. After a step over with that 90 acceleration, he's going to be gone. And 90 sprint speed as well with the Hunter Camp style is going to be very good as well. The attack positioning and finishing is good as well, but is a little bit on the low side, which is why I've decided to give him the Hunter Camp style. Make that finishing go to 94, 92 attack positioning, 93 finishing, 91 long shots. So they all should be very, very high quality stats and we're going to have to see how that plays out in game. Now passing as well, that is very good as well. 83 vision, 92 free kick accuracy, 86 short pass, 84 long pass, 90 curve. Very good. No need to touch that. Dribbling, 92 agility. Very, very good for a big man. You know, he is 6 foot 3. So we're going to have to see again how he plays in game. And if, uh, if he has a big body type or a small body type. 89 ball control, 88 dribbling, 84 reactions and 82 composure. Physicals, good heading accuracy, has a little bit of good defending, which could be very useful. And the physicals are good as well, insane stamina, he's going to last the whole 90 minutes. Strength is good, aggression might be a little bit worrying. Um, again, we're going to see how that plays out in game. Now moving on to the traits, outside foot shot, finesse shot, flare, long shot taker, all the desired traits, good weak foot as well. So yeah lads, he does look like a pretty tidy card. Um, I'm going to play him in two positions in the striker position and in the camp position just because I want to test out that passing in the camp position um, and you, you never know, he might feel better in one position rather than the other and yes we have Luis Gustavo there just for chemistry we'll be serving him off straight away for Vieira so let me put Vieira on the bench and yeah lads, this is the team let's jump to the games and see what we can do with Anderson Talisca see Anderson Talisca send him on the run can he get the head of Bailly? he can, good strength Anson Taliska, ah, oh, I missed up the shot. That's all of me, lads. But again, good pace. I said the acceleration is going to be important, and it was there. He got he got off the mark really quickly, but I missed up the shot in the end. See, Anson Taliska, good pass. Can we get that in as well? That is offside, but he ends up missing. Let's go to Taliska. Taliska, go for the trail from there. Green timed. Not a bad effort. Got a lot of power on that. That's it. Have a crack from here. Have a crack. Green timed. Puts a lot of power on his shots, but still yet to find him back in the net. Taliska has a good run, that's a beautiful run, lovely pass by Junela as well. Can you put this one away, Taliska? We can, good finish. Off the post and in. Good strength dead, hold off Maldini and he gets a goal. He's been, he's been very good inside these 30 minutes. That's it, Taliska here. Taliska hits the over. Taliska bang from there, green timed. He gets a lot of power on his shots. He really full the shot power, even when you green time it, he catches it so sweet. But again, can't quite find him back in the net. Let's go. You can go to Q on that four star weak foot. Can you go to him? Yes, he can. It's a good pass. Could we go to the end of it with Janola? Can we? Yes, we can. Beautiful. All star of Taliska on that weak foot. That long pass. That was not an easy pass to play. And he made it look so easy. Now he's been tested dribbling up. Good dribbling. That's it. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. It's beautiful. Look at the hold up play. Can we get a goal to Janola? Can we? Ah, oh, not bad. Let's go see Junla. Can you find him? Look at that four ball, lads. Beautiful pass. See Q in the middle. Can we end up getting the goal? No, unlucky. Again, Taliska started off on attacks with a beautiful pass. Unlucky not to get the goal there. Good. See Taliska, Taliska, go for outside foot shot. Green timed. Again, lads. He's getting a lot of power on the shots, but it's just about finding the back of the net. Yeah, really good angle as well. Let's do a bait. Let's go ahead and bait him. Come on, Taliska. Put it away. Let's go to free kick. Oh, unlucky. Very, very unlucky there. Try to test him up in the corner as well. That's a good cross. Telesco wins it. Come on, Telesco. Telesco on smoke this game. Just can't, can't get a goal. Go to Telesco in space. Him with the hood heel. Ginola. Yeah. Even though Telesco is not getting assists and he's not getting goal involvements, he's still being a nuisance inside the box, getting rebounds. And allowing us to score goals, which is always what you want from your attackers. You see Telesco running. Him with a step over, that's it, Telesco's gone. He's gone. Can we get a goal? Finesse near post. Good finish, Telesco. Well played. Playing really well this game. Using that pace. Like I said, boys, I knew the 98 acceleration was going to be very good. 
and there, uh, just done a step over and he jetted off so quickly past Van Dyke. And we get the rage quit. The Tesco good. That's a foot shot from there. No way, no way. Oh my days. That would have been a very good goal if that goes in. But again, as you can see, the power he gets in Travellis, that wasn't even timed. The power and curve on going that was ridiculous. So if that went in, that would have been a crazy good goal. We see Telesco on the edge. Telesco is bang from there. Telesco shot power. Way to from the keeper. But Telesco catches the shots really well with a lot of power. Got a quite fan back in it there. So you see Telesco coming short. Telesco good. Telesco near post. Green timed. Not a bad effort. We see from Donnarumma. Good win. I use that dribbling. Look at that dribbling, boys. That's good. Use that strength. Get around him. Get around him, good strength again from Talisco. And say Maximin, can we get a goal at the end of it? We can, good. Good play again. Talisco not getting a goal on assist, but he's doing well for the team. Use the strength on the line, held it up, passed it off, and we got a good goal. So you see Talisco very well. Bang on the volley. Here on the volley, what a goal. Beautiful, man. Green time on the volley. What a finish. Now, if that doesn't show you that this card isn't a fraud and he's not a cheap little player, then I don't know. What a finish, man. Green time on the volley. Passed on a rumor, one of the best keepers in the game. Man, he caught that sweet ball. Teliska. Go around him. Let's use that pace. Use that straight line speed. Oh, is he keeping him to come out? Teliska. Unlucky. But as I think see there, nothing came off it, but he used that pace. His straight line speed is very, very good. That's all I will say. See Janola. See Teliska. Him with the hood heel. Teliska from there. Oh, I didn't quite green time it. That's why he scuffed there. I didn't green time it. But then again. Going to a good position. And we scuff in the end. Disappointing. Teliska. Oh, so much space for the finish shot. Teliska, not bad. Not bad if at all. Teliska pull him short. Oh, the top water pass to Jinla. Can we get the goal? Yes, we can. Finally, Anderson Teliska gets rewarded. Beautiful first time chip over to Jinola. And we get the equalizer. Lovely. Just came in a step over. Good. Now he's acceleration. Good. Teliska on that four star week for green timed. And that might, be a little, that might be a little bit for problem, lads. Green timed from that angle on that four star week four. And he drags it wide. That's a poor shot from him. Finding little pockets. Step over in like that. Tilisco is banging from there. Green timed again. The shot path from this card is ridiculous. But it was a little bit disappointing not to score that chance a few minutes ago. So lads, that is the end of the review. We ended up playing four games with Tilisco, scoring three goals and coming out with one assist. Um, you have to bear in mind, these games were in Division 1. There were some sweaty games and I think he did really, really well to handle the opponents and the players that he had. Of course, they had the world-class players, they had Lucio, the Hullet, Vieira, Van Dykes, all the crazy good players, and he done well to outpace them, to outmuscle them, to dribble past them, and I think he done really well. For 24,000 coins, he surprised me, he played very well. Now, starting off with the pace, the acceleration, like I said in the intro, I just knew with the Hunter Camp style, the 98 acceleration was going to be crazy, and it was. I wasn't wrong. Um, step overs, he jet passed so quickly past all the good defenders, but I think it was the end product. And that's where the shooting does come into play. It is a little bit, you do feel a little, it does feel a little bit cheap, especially on that uh, four star weak foot. I did miss a big chance on a four star weak foot, green timed. I think inside the box was just on the edge and he dragged it wide. So that was a little bit disappointing, even with the Hunter Camp style, with the max shooting boost that you can give him. That was a little bit, little bit disappointing. But I did score an insane volley with him. I think the Hunter Camp style mouth helped it out. 96 volleys, green timed over the top, banging goal. You guys must have seen that from the gameplay. Crazy, crazy finish. But yeah, uh, his passing was very good. Um, dropping deep into that camp position, finding little pockets all the time. That attack position was very underrated as well. I would have to say that as well. He's always moving, finding little pockets, finding space, and doing really, really well. Yeah, his dribbling was very, very good. I would say that. Uh, he shifted it really, really well. Good balance, good dribbling, ball control. Everything was insane. So yeah, nothing about to say about the dribbling. Heading actually didn't really get to test that out. Now, the physicals, um, the strength was good. He was holding off a lot of players. Um, the aggression as well was good, but the jumping, I thought at times he was getting beaten in the air too easily, especially like him being six foot three, I expect him to win a few more headers, but jumping isn't really the end of the world if he doesn't win um, that many headers. So yeah, let's overall, a very, very good card for 24,000 coins, very, very much worth it. Um, played good, good pace, good skill moves, good work rates, and a very, very tidy card. So if you do need an impact sub, I would pick up Anderson Tiliska. Um, nothing bad to say about him, just the weak foot was a little bit of a problem, but apart from that, a very, very tidy card. So yeah lads, if you did enjoy, leave a like, comment, subscribe. I'll be dropping a lot more reviews, so stay tuned.